So I recently had a consultation with someone who's an immigrant, of course, and this person actually attended a US, um, his, her U.S. immigration interview and got arrested by ICE and detained. Um, the problem was that she did not, she was not aware that she had a deportation order issued against her in absentia. You know, sometimes I do a lot of meetings or consultations and I realize that some people have um, deportation or removal orders against them sometimes as far back as 10 years ago, five years ago, three years ago, and they are not aware. They are walking around not knowing that they are being, you know, you're, you're, you're wanted by ICE because you have a deportation order against you, right? So these are things you want to be aware of before you go in for any U.S. immigration interview. Um, now, you, you can verify by going on to the immigration court system and then you put in your A number or your alien number. So you will go in, uh, you Google EOIR. So you want to Google EOIR case status in order to find out if there is a case pending against your immigration court or, or if you have been ordered removed from the United States. And you don't only want to do this when you have um, an immigration interview. You should do this even as an immigrant. If you are not a U.S. citizen, then you are an immigrant. You have an A number if you've ever filed any type of U.S. immigration application or you've ever been issued any type of um, immigration documents. You'll have an A number, which is a nine digit number that identifies you uniquely as an immigrant. Put in this number, because what you don't want is to be walking around thinking, oh, I'm free. Um, and then you are, you've been ordered removed like two years ago and you had no idea. Here's how to check if you have a case with um, immigration courts. You Google EOIR case status. And then you click on your automated case information. And then you will accept this. Put in your A number. It's a nine-digit number. That's your alien number. As an immigrant who has applied for an immigration benefit, you get this number. Submit this. If there's no case found for this A number, then you're good to go. If you have an, a case in immigration court, it will pull up the case information. Okay, if you need help, contact us. See ya. Bye.